Well hello there my delicious friends and welcome back to a little bit more of Let's Play Final Fantasy 7 Remake with Mikey Mega Mega. This is live on twitch.tv forward slash Mikey Mega Mega. Why not join us? Welcome on in in chat. Or maybe you've got it recorded on YouTube. Hello YouTube. We are Cloud and we are Anne on a completely different new side mission that's not in the original. We've gone with Jesse up to the top plate. I think we might be in sector 7 and or 8. We've just had a fight with a number member of Soldier, um, like jumping from motorbikes. It's very Advent children tea, if that makes any sense to you. And uh, we are about to break into a Shinra location, or at least cause a distraction, so that Jesse can steal a slightly less aggressive plastic explosive uh, for the next bombing run. Uh, in our vibe, we have got... Let me just uh, sweep myself out here for a minute. Uh, just cloud for the moment. We are level 12. At nearly 1600 HP and we are currently rocking a setup of wind materia for aero healing for cure uh, deadly dodge so that I can kind of dive roll in and attack even widely dispersed enemies assess materia because we love scanning stuff right now and most importantly of all before we begun this mission we now have ifrit invoke ifrit to aid you in battle now apparently the option to use this materia you notice it's got its own special slot the option to use this material might not really be my choice. I think the way it was described is that it only becomes available when we're fighting very, very difficult enemies. But we shall see. It's a pleasure to have you in chat. We've got Todd, Chameleon S, Elizabeth the Tree Wizard, Davidson Grandpa, Daniel Overkill, you lovely people. Thank you so much for joining me for more of the adventure. Let's sneak our way in. Just need to get past this gate. Wait. Where are the guards? Because <laughs> Alistair, thank you for the bitties, man. I hope you're doing well out there. Much love, dude. <laughs> Looks like someone beat us here. And I don't think it was Jesse. This had better not get in the way of our plans. It worked. Annex. Warehouses are further in. Jesse's supposed to be circling around from the back, right? Where are you going, Bob? This way. Okay, just making sure I can't get anything. Oh, I think we can rest here. Oh, can we use these machines? Energy drink and potions. Oh, it's a vending machine shop. Uh, I'm pretty much good for... Oh, wait, we can buy weapons and armors from here? Talk to me really quickly. Guys, it is a Iron Bangle Star Bracelet vibe. Now, I was saving up for a Star Bracelet. I never got around to being able to afford one. I really wanted it because of the two slots. And then I utterly forgot that we were trying to do that. So I still don't have enough money for one of these things. Hmm, goddammit, society. Another time. However, sitting down right here... Actually, do you know what? I might sell something. I might... Guys, what can we get rid of? I spent all my extra money on these talismans. Mm, it wasn't a great shout. Basically, I'm selling these back at half price. I might do it. I might sell just one of them so I can afford the uh, bangle. I'm just getting some good clicks out of my spine. I'm not going to sell off my materia. Oh, I could drop a cheeky ether. If I sell two ether... I'll get that second slot. Mm. Oh! Oh wait, did I buy one? That's, oh my god! Oh, my. oh shit, maybe I did buy one. Okay guys, we either bought one, or I picked one up. But guys, I think we've actually got some star bracelet opportunity already. So let me just come out of this really, really quickly. Pop into our menu. Have a quick look at this. Material and equipment, cloud. Iron bangle. I love it. Oh, the music's very atmospheric. Guys, as ever, let me know if the uh, audio levels are, you know, a good balance against me talking over it. But guys, cloud's got an iron bangle. We're going to switch out to a star bracelet. It lowers my uh, physical and magic defense by a fair whack. But, mate, I like those slots. Do you know what I'm saying? I like those slots. 
So transferred automatically is for healing material. We've got arrow, we've got cure. This is a great opportunity to put in probably thunder because you never know when you're against robots when you're in a Shinra facility. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Oh, what a lovely day. That being said, can I... No, I've only got four SP. I need like six now for the next stage. Anyway, guys, this is going very, very well. I think that girl Jessie likes Cloud, and he might kind of like her. What do you all think, modern community? Uh, I think she's working on him. She's working on him, which means... I suspect Jesse's going to die quite terribly so that the gateway gets opened up for Cloud to be interested in Tifa or Aerith. I don't think Jesse's going to have a good time of it. Jesse's family is in the Sector 7 upper plate. I think it's very strange and in some ways interesting that they're elaborating on the Star Wars references. It's ki it is kind of interesting. Okay, guys. Bojack, you sound like the kind of person. I'm not saying this is the case, by the way. I'm just It reminds me of somebody else. Uh, we used to know somebody who would always read up about stuff on the internet and then they'd pretend that they'd noticed it themselves all the time, like the next day at school. And we'd just be like, mm, you don't usually talk like this. This is a little bit weird. Anyway, guys, level 12, in it to win it. Let's max out my HP and MP by having a short rest on a bench. I love it he adjusts his sword for that sit down. They're like, Cloud, we need to break into here. And Cloud's just like, yeah, 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 yeah. Just give me a solid six hours and I'll, uh, I'll be right with you. Oh, it's a training center. Any Shinra crates? Ah, <gasps> well, well, well. Oh, I've just run right through that table. Two high potions. Hi, Potion. I'm Dad. Ooh, can we? This is weird. This has got a really weird vibe down here. So this is just like a gun training area where they fire at targets. Interesting. They really made a good remake in my opinion. Zeus, so far I'm loving it. There's a few kind of extra side bits that are a bit bleh. And uh, this other soldier character who's just like, oh hey, I'm Captain Jump on a Bike Roach. He's a little bit, they're all a bit zany. And because I know where it's artificially put in, like where it's not part of the original story, I don't know if it leaps out of me as being a little bit false or shallow because of that, or if they are just designed a bit differently. Some critique on a combat system, though. Uh, it's not quite got the same paciness and quick delivery that the original had. What are you saying, bruv? No need for us to rush. Let's scout it out first. I can handle this solo. What? You're trying to keep us out of it now? Don't be a jackass. We're in this together. Don't expect me to save you. If you need to check your gear, now's the time. I'm gonna eat this. Give the word when you're good to go. You can use that vending machine over there to stock up. Sometimes, a limited quantities of useful items in bottles, ether, and high potion are offered at special, special prices. Buy as many as you can. Wait, were the prices especially good? Guess there's a training center too. Could go a few rounds before the main event. Man, I get really hungry when I'm nervous. Training center? To be fair, I only looked at the weapons and armor. I've got some of these. I might buy another bolt. There's 500 gil here, but I'll want it later for when I've got a larger party. Okay, guys, you're creeping me out with your, we're about to die, let's go train separately. Let's, uh, 
Let's not go train separately. Let's let's fucking live our lives. Hey, where are you going? Oh my god. I'm ready, aren't you? Remind me, you've got summoning material, don't you? Mm -hmm. There's no better way to deal with big groups. You'd be crazy not to equip it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's go over the plan one last time. You start things off by cutting loose where everyone can see you. And us? We're the backup. First, we climb high enough to get a vantage point, then we go to town on them. Heya. So, what did you want to talk about? When spring comes, I'm leaving town. I'm going to Midgar. Should have figured. All the guys are leaving. But, but I'm not like them. I'm not going just to look for work. I'm going to be a soldier. The best of the best. Like Sephiroth. The great war hero, huh? Hmm. Isn't it pretty hard to become a soldier? Yeah. So I won't be back for a long time. Guess not. Think you'll be in the papers? I'll try. Just promise me one thing. When we're older, and you're a famous soldier, if I'm ever trapped or in trouble, promise you'll come and save me. Huh? That's what heroes do. They save people. Please? Just once. Uh... Come on, promise me. Fine. I promise. you're having second thoughts I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference but not like this I just I feel trapped <sighs> that's the signal all according to plan. Let's go. Right. Yeah! So does that mean Cloud's going to stick around now? Because he's just realized this is his opportunity to help Tifa. He can't just leave Avalanche. Oh, wait. So you two just fuck off? <laughs> he's doing very well for himself. I guess I'm just... I, I'm, I'm too, I'll, I'll go over here. Don't mind me. No one authorized access. There's another group here ahead of us. Who's been knocking out those guards? I love that this doorway looks like a um, half of a gun chambering round for a six-shooter. Revolver, some people say. Mr. Lord Kickass, I hope you're well. Bojack, welcome on in. Davidson Grandpa. She was cute. Man, Sab, I hope you're good. He's lucky he's cute. He is lucky he's cute because he's not got much else going on. I love how in this game, you choose your haircut when you're five years old and you never change it. Okay. So I'm here to cause an I don't see any intruders. <clears throat> Maybe they went home. Oh, hey, over there. Target, target sight. Light him up. <laughs> Oh, that cutscenes with that sword. Give up? Kill the bastard! 
Oh, so I'm gonna roll an attack. Roll an attack to get the group. So let's just uh, thunder that guy because he's got the best HP. Oh, caning him is fantastic. I'm just really here to cause a mess and get their attention as well. And you can dodge their gunfire from a distance instead of having to block. Mate. Triple slash. Let's go. Any shimmer boxes worth them? Oh, we just gone up level. Oh, who's this guy? Oh, he's one of the grenadiers. Oh, so this is just a slash fest. We can just absolutely mull of these guys. I'm waiting. Look at him trying his best. Yeah, you you showed me. Any time now. Oh. Uh, oh, you gotta be shitting me. Give me a bit more time, and I got you. tipped it over. Good lads. <laughs> Cheeky potion. Right. Oh. Don't let him okay, this gun turret's so problematic. Do you want to knock it over, mate? So long. Here we go. Okay, let's get under defensive move. There we go. Okay, bullets. Let's get deep on that de defense. Let's do this. Okay, I need some health really quickly. Let's go for a high potion immediately. That's that. Oh, I love that juggling. Okay, I've really got to keep moving because... Okay, thank you, mate. Thank you, mate. The camera's locked on them whenever a vet happens, so I'm always forcibly looking up. Oh. I'd really love to use my summon. Uh... Storm's coming. All right. 
Are you still running around? Oh, I've got the multiple uh, roll attack. Yes, it goes straight into a stagger. That roll is everything. Roll attack materia. That being said, limit break, cross slash you. Anyway, works. I don't know where that dog is, but I'm assuming I fucked it. All good. Look at him. He's still. Oh, he's getting tired. <laughs> Dog's still getting him in the ass. Mate, I'm here for you. Pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Hell of a show, man. Hate to be Trahedo, man. The ladies loved you that much. I'm glad someone's enjoying themselves. <sighs> this is why I have thunder equipped. Of course, they store Max here. You ready? Hell yeah. More than you know. Look what I found. Let's give these jerks a taste of their own medicine. <laughs> the summon gauge. Oh, finally. When facing formidable enemies in battle, the entity slumbering within an equipped summoning materia may begin to stir. And the summon gauge may appear. When this gauge is completely filled, you can call upon the summon for assistance. Yep, 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 yep. I'm down. Oh, you fucker. He broke my uh, ability attack. How dare you. I need to get back on this guy. Summon, 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 summon. Oh, it's not full. Limit, limit, limit. Cross slash this motherfucker. Yes, mate. Oh, yes, mate. Yes, yes. Okay, I need to block now. There we go. That's maxed out my bar. Summon Ifrit, please. Duty calls. Fuck yes! Look at him! Look at him! Oh shit, he looks like trouble, my first summon. Summons fight alongside you for a brief period and their remaining time is indicated by the decreasing gauge. These beings have a will of their own and they engage the enemy as they see fit. However, you can command them to unleash unique attacks by expending your ATB charges. When a summon gauge is completely depleted, the summon will execute a devastating ultimate attack before they depart. Shit the bed. You're a wizard, Harry. I was supposed to be a wizard, Harry. So here's Ifrit. Just fucking this guy up now. Just, I have a demon on my side. Oh, I was trying to dodge that horrible attack. I, uh... I could really do some defending. Okay, now I really need... Uh, a potion or two. I'm just going to potion myself a little bit whilst Still Ifrit in. does all the cheese. Come on. Ifrit's just mulling him in the background. Summon ability. Should we have a look? Crimson Dive. Yes, please, Ifrit. Oh, it's just like a massive barrel bomb. I'm going to stand behind the uh, immortal demon. I don't even know what this thing is on the floor that he put there. Oh, I want to put them on the mines. 
Oh, no worries. Right. Oh, it's staggered him! Lovely. Yes, yes, we'll see staggered. Let's go straight in with a focused thrust. An Ifrit. Thousand and eighty-six damage. Now that's what I call teamwork. <laughs> Stay where you are. Yeah. Uh, well, shit. Okay, this would have been a better time. <laughs> All right, assholes, show me your hands. <laughs> oh, this prick. <laughs> You know what I want. A second dance. Just the two of us. You turned the key. The engine roars with excitement. This music's quite good. It hungers to be set free! Fall back. Uh, uh, right. Uh, Come on. Uh, uh. It's been a long time since I fought a duel out of the saddle. But for all the miles on the clock. I'm just as fast as I ever was. At last, Whoa, he just maxed out my HP and MP. Are you nuts? Your material has improved enough that a more potent spell is available. For example, in the case of Fire Spell, the potency increases from Fire to Fire Ra, and finally to Fire Aga. To access a more powerful version, press sideways on the commands, but it uses more MP. Oh my god, Cure! Oh, my Cure's gone up to Cura. Good to know. Ah, I'm not going to need that right now. Let's just uh, arrow this guy for a sec. Roach. Me. I want to get a counter. There we go. This hyperdramaticness is way cooler than it. When he was on a motorbike, I'd had enough of him. This, I can't lie. This is fucking awesome. This I really like. Here it comes. Yeah. Okay, uh. like 1,100. Oh, he broke my uh, move. Oh, I'm still doing it. 500 hit points. Yep. I can see him almost building up to that swing. I need to get those blocks in. Now, still took off 131 HP. I'm almost there with blocks. Pay attention. This 
I need that counter in. Okay, let me just go straight into counter mode. Let's do this. And now, oh, there we go. Oh, now he, now he casts fire instead. You bastard. There we go. Block and counter. Then I've got those moves. We are going to Cura again, though. Let's try that again. Right, let's uh, start dodging his vibe. No holding back. I'm still not getting those dodges in in time, but almost there. Oh, whoa, he's he's just going for it every time. No worries. Let's give him a cheeky assess so I've got him logged on my uh, business. Allow me. I only have eyes for you. Oh. Got most of those dodges in there. Yeah. Ah, oh my god. Never again. Look, 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 look. In the blink of an eye. Shall I keep you company? Second win. Limit on his stagger immediately. Cross slash. 600, Was that 272 or 2000? Must have been 200. I was just thinking a bit big there. Satisfied? Cross slash on the stagger. <laughs> With such fleeting pleasure, hardly. <sighs> there are higher heights to which you and I can still soar. So, like, are those two going out now, or? <clears throat> Yeah, he's more annoying when he's back on a bike. We really must do this again. Until then, try not to die. I'll see you on the road, my friend. <laughs> I think there's something wrong with your bike. God damn it. will be fine, but you won't be if they start asking questions. What? And who are they? First guests to the party, another avalanche cell. Our holier-than-thou friends from the old guard. <laughs> it's always their way or the highway. Lately, they've been a real pain in the ass. Till now. <laughs> 
There's another cell of avalanche? So then why are they here? Beats me. We've been on the outs ever since our cell got labeled too extreme. Though they're the ones running around with Millspec gear. Word is, they cut a deal with Wutai. Promised them all the materia in Midgar, apparently. Think there's any truth to that? You tell me. Sometimes, I think we're the only ones who've realized the war's over. <clears throat> okay, mission complete. Let's make our way back to the lot. Right. Looking a lot more crowded now. I have Security no idea where course. this game is going. Uh, just what we need. Can I still have a nap in the middle of the fight? <laughs> I'm just going to take a cheeky four hours. Lovely, I'm fully rested. Good sleep, everyone. Let's give this a really quick save as well whilst we're here. Holy shit. Guys, that was rather intense. How are you guys doing in chat? Shop is still here. You're a summon, Terry. A rogue soldier. It says so in his descriptions. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just scanned that guy. Let's have a look at his scan. Avalanche started in a town far away from Midgar. It is a large terrorist organization. I had no idea. I thought Avalanche was literally five people. Do you remember your first blowjob? If yes, how did it taste? Fleshy. Okay, okay. So. Enemy intel. Firstly, the hoodlum we fought in the last episode. Man wearing clothes, decorated with a Gaudi dragon emblem. Remember these hoodlums? Do you know what? The angle and taper of his haircut. My fringe, my forehead's bigger and my fringe is higher. But the angle and taper of his haircut is exactly my haircut. I'm very upset about this hoodlum. Roche, here we go. A third class soldier! Roche is a third-class soldier operator who loves bikes, speed, and anyone capable of going toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. He is ostracized by many in the organization. However, due to his antics and general disregard for anyone's safety. I see, he doesn't care about the system. He is soldier, third class. Hitting him with physical strikes and blocking his attacks will eventually make him easier to interrupt. He's weak against fire. So this is Roche, soldier, third class. Mm. Looks like an 80s power character. He looks like you've crossed David Bowie with a death metal band with a D&D &D warrior. Very interesting. Power ballad, more like it. There's a bunch of losers watching video games. Disgusting. I'm in quarantine with my hot girlfriend who won't go off my cock, but you plebs will never know that feeling. Shoffy, you wish. You bloody wish. I'm back. Shoffer's... Shoffer's girlfriend, everybody. Shoffer met his girlfriend the day he had an operation to remove his lower floating ribs. Spending time with a GF. Okay. Right, where are we going? We are getting out of here. So, are we not going to wait for Wedge? If we stuck around or went back, he'd only get upset. Why is that? Because a soldier wouldn't understand. 
Don't tell him you're worried about him, huh? You made it! Over here! Do you reckon she's a spy working for Shinra? Could you have been any louder? And she lured me into a trap. Made my job a lot easier, but wait, where's Wedge? <gasps> Wedge! That was close. We'll go get him. Hmm. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Come on. Not my finest hour. You get hit. Just swinged, I think. Uh, oh, shot! Uh, really? Let me see. Are we seriously doing this here? Wait, what? That's... Wow. What? What? You guys are the worst. Huh? Your ass is fine. What is their relationship? Maybe singed, but the only casualty is your underwear. This is like a bruise or a mild burn at worst. Hmm? <clears throat> Now that was a gunshot. <laughs> Is that a smile I spy? Mm -hmm. oh, cloud light tip. <laughs> it's not safe here. We should go. <laughs> Copy, Copy that. that. Hmm. We apologize for any inconvenience or confusion. So, how do we get back to the slums? With a little trick I've been dying to try out. Hey Chitoremo, welcome on back in. Hey there, man. Oh, they're all in a trio relationship. That's going to be my fan art. My fan art of Jesse is going to be Jesse standing there, but it's going to be Wedge and Biggs taking off her armor and taking off her trousers. But she's like the Dom, and they're both her subs. All residents are to return to their homes and remain indoors until further notice. I repeat, for your safety, go home. I heard someone say it was an attack. Hey, it was those terrorists, right? There has been no attack. For your safety, please go home and remain indoors until further notice. An emergency has been declared. All civilians are to remain indoors. Hmm, everyone's out in the streets. Nobody's noticing the suspiciously well-armed people running in the other direction. The 7-6 annex is on. Right. This is it. Through here and we're home free. Where exactly are we going? Any stuff to get? Hey, Cloud! We're going this way! Please remain indoors. Just keep an eye out for any treasure. Oh, I have to. Yeah, me too. For your dad's sake. Hey, what the hell, man? Huh? Oh, we're between uh, city streets. Saying how we hope to come back and try the Midgard special next time. Really, huh? Cloud said that? Sure did. Wants a whole pie to himself. Isn't that right? That's... that's right. Ooh. Well, okay then. Maybe I'll lend Mom a hand next time too. That'd be awesome. Metal. Super duper awesome. A Moogle medal, my friend. What is this? It's just a casually lying piece of materia. Revival materia. Look at this area. Oh my god. So we've run down from between the streets up on the plate. And we've just gone down an alley. It's like more like a slew sacrifier. And down there are the slums. This game. Man, they have built Midgar so fucking good. Where are we going? Patient, it's worth it. It is. What are we waiting for? But Dave's and Grandpa's right. Should be somewhere around here. Bingo. Hmm? 
I have figured my dad got it wrong, but nope. They're here just like he said. Parachutes? Mm -hmm. huh? I'd love it if what it was just a load of nooses. 50-50 <laughs> is pretty good odds if you ask me. <laughs> this is gonna be Wait, fun. Uh, uh, <sighs> Damn, Mikey's a rapper. Wait, what have I done? Thanks, guys. I really appreciate you coming all this way with me. And like I said before, I'd be grateful if you kept this between us until after the mission. I don't want to complicate things. Sure. <laughs> this has been okay, the weirdest side mission. Me, me. Hey, Cloud. You let him down gently, all right? Yep. Wait. I almost forgot. One more thing. Whoa! S stop it! Whoa. What in the hell are you trying to? Uh. Ooh. Ooh. Easy, you'll make us fall. Not if you do first. Is she trying to kiss me? Swing by my place after, so I can pay you in full. Oh. <laughs> no! <laughs> Wait! Give me a minute! No. Why you have to be such a hard ass, bro? I ain't your bro. <laughs> Done more. I thought that was Cloud's hand. Hurt. You did enough. You took one for the team. Be proud. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Feels like we're flying high these days. <laughs> now, more than ever. He's a keeper, all right. Yeah. Together, we can take on the world. That really felt like a filler episode to an anime, do you know what I mean? Where by the beginning and the end of the episode, absolutely nothing needs to have happened. Well, that was very interesting, guys. I did too, Mikey. Chutoremo. Wait, what have we done? Love you guys. I love you guys. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Welcome back. I'll head home on my own. After all, I'm only a little sore. <laughs> it's cool. We'll go together. Aw, thanks, bro. <sighs> Cut that out. Is he my girlfriend? <laughs> this way. Think Jesse and Biggs made it back safe? I guess. Cool if we check on them? We'll pass by their places anyway. Sure. Let's give this a save. Oh, I've used up all my save slots. Eh, hey, man. Eh, hey, man. Okay. Is that a PlayStation thing or a game thing? Does the game limit the amount of saves I have? Or is it to do with my PlayStation memory? I think a save file is like 200 megabytes these days or something. Okay, it is a lovely night back down at the slums. We've had a lovely adventure where we all bonded together. I learnt about Jesse's family. I'm just going to have a quick pop back here because whenever you land somewhere, you automatically go the other way because it's a video game, right? What is this area like by night? I have no idea. There's one way to find out. Oh, I don't know where I am. What slum am I in? I'm in the Scrap Boulevard. Hmm. 
Here we go. Easy. Maybe I can do that combo attack. I mean the, the dive roll thing. Oh wait, I think I unequipped that material, didn't I? Don't even know if I have it. It's not important. Let's go. This is a fairly simple slashing side sojourn. the shit out of it. Not bad. Well, well, well. It's a Star Wars for We fell into the Sarlacc. It is a Star Wars ref. TOS 9 to full. How you doing, man? Mikey, you see, Mikey, you need another memory card. I think I might... I'm running out of memory space. <laughs> I remember once I rented Final Fantasy 7 from Blockbuster. And I just played it all weekend with no memory card. I just left my PS PlayStation on the whole time. I didn't die once. And then I just gave it back. God, do you remember renting stuff for an absurd amount of money at Blockbuster? Jesus. God damn it, you're still there. Mission failed, boys. He's still keen. Okay, mate. Because it's you. I just go all the way around in a... Yeah. Hmm. Hello, mate. I guess we're going all the way home with him. I wonder where he lives. Hello, mate. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. No. Nope. Nothing new. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel Blockbuster hype. They really minted money in those days. Yeah, they when they did well, they did well. There's actually one Blockbuster still alive in the world. It's in California. Oh, because it's hip. Wait, was Blockbuster a franchise? Rally of Monster Slaying. Got new numbers for Monster Slaying this month. Check them out. She keeps updating me even when I do it in the dark. I know we're going with him, but let's just check out. Do you know what? This weapon shop looks great at night. The slums are a better vibe at night. There's more rats, though, but that's a problem. Got customers lining up around the block to get their hands on big old swords like yours. Yep. Star bracelet, iron bangle. Nothing new? Hmm. I've got good money. I could buy a bulletproof vest just for shits and giggles. Increases vitality by 5%. I'll hold off for now. I don't know what I want to do with my money. People down here want a better life. See anything weird? Tell us. It scares me to death thinking there might be more to come. At least the kids aren't hanging out here. Oh, this. Are you here to play too? I like playing the part. Do you? Are you a creepy evil ghost? I think you might be my least favorite favorite character. I'm not supposed to be here. I'm sick, so I should be at home. But I sneak out at night a lot. COVID. How dare you? I wonder if there's a story around that character. That's really weird. Do you know what? Is there, can we do more side missions here when it's nighttime? Does that change up the options? Hmm. Ladies? Secret reactor jobs? Even people from the Undercity are allowed to do them. 
Secret jobs? It's just a rumor, but the pay is supposed to be amazing. Thing is, you can't apply. You have to be selected. That sounds pretty sketchy, actually. Hell yeah. Come on, you know you want it. And he has iron swords. I wonder what the hard edge will look like. You know, there's serious money to be made working inside the reactors. It's super curious, dude, because it's like, it's all about upgrading your swords, not just uh, buying loads and loads of different variations on swords. With that, yeah, I do like a quiet night. Warm nights in Japan are fantastic. So with that in mind, guys, let's go and see if we've got enough SP points to unlock some more jazz and ting. So I'm mostly uh, repping for my iron blade at the moment got 17 for my buster sword i can't wait to start using that but for the moment let's check all this thing Whoa! okay so we've done the iron blade core upgrades now we can do the iron blade sub core upgrades everything costs six attack power magic power or physical defense up the thing is my my Buster Sword has a higher attack rating this whole time. I'm just using this one because it's got the extra materia slot. Because I do like scanning people. Hmm. Yeah, let's just up my standard attack power. Nice. We'll come back for the Buster Sword in a bit. Um, I can take the Triple Slash now back to the Buster Sword. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. By the looks of it, there's going to be seven, maybe more, but possibly no more than seven swords. Maybe an eighth for the ultimate weapon. But it looks like the real trick is just upgrading these swords in particular and just maxing them out. Hmm. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. Just in case we come back to Tifa, I might as well vibe her right now. Leather gloves. Oh! So we've done everything for Tifa except up her attack power a little bit more. And then Leather Glove Subcore. Oh, the Subcore. A new. Ma oh shit! She can get another slot! Yes! Immediately this one. Because Alistair, thank you for the bitties. I wonder how that new materia slot is going to physically look on her gloves in the game. Hmm. Because Alistair, you're an absolute star. Thank you. It is what it is. Like a topal. Yeah, man. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this is coming off great. Battle Intel. What's this? The extreme conditions in which certain monsters thrive have provided them with unique curative abilities. Oh, this is from that kid, the Shinra kid. So we've done Monster Bio Part 1. Uh, Monster Bio Part 2, or Report 2, Magic Elements 1. Hit enemies vulnerable to fire, ice, or lightning using the appropriate magic. So I've done that, that's why he gave me arrow. And then Report 3, the Stagger Effect. Use unique abilities on staggered enemies and change the ATB gauge 10 times. I happen to have just done that naturally as well. That's why he just smashed it out and gave me first strike for a really good price. So we're currently working on report number four, Stagger Effect Part 2. Research shows that staggering one's foes positively impacts morale in battle. I aim to analyze this phenomenon and replicate a similar sensation via materia. Stagger 15 enemy types. I've staggered 9 out of 15 types of enemies, but I don't know who or what they are. I do, under enemy intel, it'll tell me if I've done a stagger maybe. So like, if we go to Wraith Hound, yeah, I've not staggered a Wraith Hound. I've not staggered a Guard Dog. Wait, does this tell me, wait, have I done any of this to any of this? Who have I staggered? Oh, the, oh if it says staggered, it means I have done it. Okay, so I've staggered a Scorpion Sentinel. I've staggered this. Oh, I've staggered Roach. I've staggered a Huntsman. I've staggered the Drakes. I've not staggered any lesser Drakes, so I could go back to the um, warehouse and do that. Not done a Gorger either. Which one's a Gorger? 
Oh, I've not staggered these insect boys. It's because I usually kill them too quickly. That's a bit tough. Okay, we need to just stagger loads and loads of boyos. I'm down. I am down for stagger town. The hell did Avalanche think that being good? done, let's go. Um, let's go back to Wedge. Before we do talk to Wedge, let's just double check we can't go in here. Seventh Haven's really popular in the evening. Oh yeah, I can't go in. My relationship's still not great. I'm assuming this is a lesser pub. Guess he's about to buy the um, petty in third class petty officer. Oh! You're going to become a petty officer! Because Alistair! Because Alistair! Hey, fucking congratulations, man! That's dope! You guys are fantastic. Holy shit, bruv! Oh! Some guy snooping around town, acting like he's here cruising for girls. Wall market fella, yeah? He tried to hit on you too? Yeah, not me. Guessing you weren't his type, but uh, sure are mine. Oh, good lad. Yeah. Trying his luck. Hmm. Food's dog shit, but I ain't here to eat. Oh, you're open all hours. Any cool new stuff? If it isn't our favorite Merc. So, what are you looking for? You name it, it's here. Mm. Da, da. Not interested. Okay, go on. Let's go talk to Wedge. I've left him hanging a bit. Oh. Is she putting on a stage play? What do you mean? Or was it faked by Wu Tai to destabilize Midgar before they invade? <gasps> Now they're mentioning Wu Tai. Interesting. Sorry, bruv. How are you doing? Well, this is Big's place. I guess he hasn't made it home yet. Guess not. Maybe him and Jesse are. Hope he isn't worst casing it again. He's got a habit of overthinking things, worrying about all the possible outcomes till his head hurts. Wouldn't have guessed. And when he worries, I worry. <laughs> anyway. Let's head on over to Jesse's. Hmm. Come on, bro. Let's get going. Now we know where he lives, huh? What do you want to bet? We're going to find uh, Biggs very deep in Jesse. I think they had a really good time floating down. Do you know what I'm saying? Jesse wasn't wearing a harness. You know what I'm saying? She was locked in by a different method. You know what I'm saying? penis I'm one step closer to my dream of Master Chief Xalister you Xalister I hope you're aware that you're a fucking dope individual man hats off to you keep that work up bro this is where Jesse lives men are not allowed inside <sighs> lots of pretty girls trying to make it big on stage live here so don't hang around or they might get the wrong idea Huh. Good to know. I'm telling you this for your own good, Cloud. People around here love to gossip. They know about Jesse and Avalanche? Nah, it's all good. They think she's an actress. Oh, and one more thing, bro. It's all a game to her. Don't fall for it. You lost me. <laughs> Life's a stage and loves the play. He's basically warning me not to simp. I think he might be right. She's all flirt and no Bert. Do you know when a girl's onto you, Benny realizes she's nothing but Ernie? No Bert at all. All right, I'm out. I'm gonna have some dinner. Todge, enjoy your dinner. Look after yourself. No resorting to the undercounter the drugs to stay awake. No promises. Oh, he lives in one of the cat alley places, does he? Oh, he's a cat boy. Is this his house? Hey there, bigums. Reggie, Smalls. Brought a new friend to meet you. What? These little guys are on guard duty today. <laughs> okay. Thanks for seeing me home. Really sorry about your ass. 
It's all good, bro. It's kind of weird when you call me that. Hey, don't be scared. Deep down, he's a big softy. It's okay. It's okay. Good job, guys. Great work. Oh, oh I missed you too. Oh, big arms. All of this so tough. zany cheesiness is starting to rub off on me. <laughs> I'm starting to feel it now. I was like, I don't want to know about these slums. And now I'm just like, ah, oh, okay, okay. All right, mate. Let's say goodnight to him now. Good night, mate. Good night, mate. Hey, bro. Want to chill with me and the gang for a bit? Uh, who's the gang? The cats, dummy. Who else? Bigamous Rex? Reginaldo? Mr. Smalls? Right. Have you guys seen that Twitter post about the guy who lost his cat? And then he found he found his cat, so he took his cat home. And then later, his cat came home. And now he has two cats, which are identical. Do you guys know what this post is? It's just... it's That's literally the entire story, but it comes with a photo. And every time I see it, it's like a wild ride. It makes me laugh. Mind checking on the others again for me? Thanks. Oh, and have a good night. Yeah, no worries, man. All your other cats are looking good. Bigums, Mr. T-Rex, Johnny Smalls. Fat cat's having a great time up there. They've mapped loads of cat movements. That's really good. We have to dress a cat in a tiny little cat suit with lots of white dots on it for the... Uh... No, I don't know how they do it. Maybe that is how they do it. Okay, good night, mate. Have a good evening. Man, do you know what? Wedge is all right. Wedge lives down here in the slums with his collection of cats. I'm slowly building a bond, not just with the slums, but I'm caring more and more about the rest of Avalanche. And I think we're going to have a long and bright future together with this team. I think these are obviously the main characters of the game that are going to stick with me. You know about the secret reactor jobs? Even people from the underside. Everyone and their mother knows it. No matter what the future holds, I'm so sick of the life. Where am I going? What's my objective? Oh, yeah, Jesse said meet me at my house, didn't she? Yeah, for my payment, huh? I remember. Hey, Michael T. Sauce. How you doing? Those two cats are exactly the same. How dare you? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they are exactly the same as well. Okay, guys. Well, if it isn't Cloud Strife, was wondering when you'd show up. Without further ado, here you are. Thanks for stepping up, Merc. <laughs> and now, Cherry on top. Okay, I get it. Mind letting me breathe? Depends. Mind coming over tomorrow night? My roommates should all be out for a while. Are you seriously that desperate? Just let go already. Only if you promise to come back tomorrow night. Deal? No promises versus not happening. I can't believe that Cloud's getting a relationship. With Jesse? Holy shit, that's kind of sweet. Yeah, I'm not going to be mean to her. No promises, but you know. Don't simp to her! We did get warned not to simp to her. But sometimes you got to simp, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> no promises, but I'll think it over. Really? You will? I'd make a mean pizza, I'll have you know. Marsh, Louche, Black Millie, Red Shelly. I use only the best ingredients. Sound good? Uh, never heard of any of that stuff. Oh, you are so adorable, you know that? You just leave everything to me. It'll be great. <laughs> Nighty night. Psych. Wait, what? What does that last psych mean? Does that mean I'm not coming around tomorrow? Does that mean she... Wait, does that either mean she can't cook or I'm not coming around? I have... N I, 
my god, I'm standing with my dick in the wind when it comes to her. I've got no idea what's going on. Big simping, spending cheese. Big simping on the LADs. I'm a follow, like them, love them, donate, feed them. But I kind of fucking need them. Follow them on Twitter. <laughs> Give them a little bit of. But I don't fucking leave them. I'm a pimp in every sense. I'm a simp in every sense of the word, bitch. What are you talking about? Fuck, I'm leaving. This creepy midnight child, there's got to be something to her. Okay, guys, I'm going to do a cover song of Big Pimping Spending Cheese. And it's going to be called Big Simping. And, uh, guys, internet career, we're going to be famous. I stayed up all night thinking about the reactor bombing. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Yeah, I think she might be a ghost as well. Uh, guys, I guess we're just gonna, what, go to bed for the night? We are, we're gonna just, uh, vibe. Slum wisdom, huh? Oh, hello, mate. Here you are. We found him. Oh, hey, Cloud. Survived the jump? How's Wedge? He's fine. <sighs> well, that's good to hear. Tomorrow's a really big day. For all of us. When Wedge said he'd been shot, I was afraid we'd have to call off the whole damn thing. Heading topside in secret, I don't think I could have faced Barrett if something had happened. But Jesse had been acting weird, and I knew I couldn't just ignore her. Biggs. She must be prepping the bomb right now. But will she be able to finish before morning? Why should go and see if she needs any... Biggs. Huh? Uh, sorry. Our chute was blown pretty far off course. It felt like a bad omen or something. So... Get some rest. You need it. Roger. Night. Night. And thanks, really. Oh no. Our dinner date with Jesse is the night after the next reactor raid. Yeah. How's how are you doing sweeping filth? Yeah, you didn't get me. Tomorrow's going to be a success. I know it. We've all put in the work. I 100% agree. Tomorrow's going to work out really well. So we've talked to all three of those lovelies. What do you mean? Or was it I'm just going to go into the secret cat place. I think, guys, if we end up with a team again, where I've got multiple players... Oh, this light's on. I still can't enter this place. If we uh, end up in a team with a large party again, I might switch out for my um, Buster Sword again. Max out all of its SPs, just because it's a little bit stronger. Because I don't need to worry about slightly fewer slots if... I've got loads of other team members casting all the different material. Because I do like to mix it up, you know what I'm saying? It's like when we play Witcher, I like to mix up the swords, mix up the outfits. There's loads of people chilling at night. It's a relatively warm night under the plates. I really like this place. You know what? I think these slums are okay. They're full of okay people. Great ratings. Good crowds. I need to stagger some more um, stuff and ting for this guy. Hmm. I haven't done those arrow things. Where am I compared to that factory? I might slip my sweet self over to the abandoned factory if I can, guys. Just to see if I can stagger some of those air lizards. So you're the baby face, Merkwitch. 
I'm getting this odd kind of feeling that maybe doing that sort of stuff now might be better than doing it later. Don't ask me why. Reload. Reload? Reload? What have I done? You want me to you want me to reload the game and not be nice to her? You want me to say no to her? You guys are cold. I didn't realize I had such an ice cold crowd in here. It might be hot summer outside, but I was just like, hey, I'm not that boiling. I wonder why. Now I know. You're as cold as ice. Oh, there's two routes in. Oh, no. This leads. This is just a, a different combat way. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the way in and round to the left. The real Ladies. Play the way you want to. Are you guys taking the piss out of me because I started simping for Jesse? <laughs> I'm a real pushover for a flirt. Do you know what? I'm a pushover for a flirt in almost any situation except work. And when I'm at work, I am absolutely immune to that shit because I know it only leads to more work. But outside of that, I'm just like, ooh, attention from a woman. Oh. Anyway. Burning the midnight oil, are we? You keep your head on a swivel out there. Burning. What does that mean? Mikey's just a big romantic. Anyway. So basically, guys, the reason I'm here is I want to fight everything I can. Specifically, I want to stagger everything I can. Because... I've staggered... 9 out of 15 enemies. And I'll get a boost material if I do. Problem is... I don't know if there's 6 more enemies in this area that will do it. But I know that one of them that I haven't done... Is the Lesser Drake. So let's do a Lesser Drake. And uh, anything else that I find in here. Oh, a Moogle medal. Uh, what am I doing with these medals? In my uh, inventory. Key items. I've got eight of these. Watch security key. Combat analyzer. Hmm. Anyway. Oh, you bastard. It's locked at night. It's locked! Ah, oh, you bugger! I don't think I can do anything. Unless... Oh, is it this way over... Oh. It might have always been this way. Okay, ignore me. Seriously. Okay, let, I need to stagger these guys. Oh, I can't... I've got no one to help me. Do I just have to take the sucking and the poisoning? Oh, do you know what? This is a bit more, uh, it's a bit less dangerous when you've got a friend. It's pressured, but I can't stagger it without killing it. I think I need to, uh, I need to hit it with materia. Now, I don't know what they're weak against. But I haven't checked. Let me uh, thunder this. Buzz off. Staggerdies about murdering them. Maybe if I lose, use lower level attacks like grenades and stuff, just to wind up its HP. They're very friendly, aren't they? Cloud's getting milked. Oh my! Cloud, all of your goo. So what are those disgusting things called? Gorges, right? They're weak against frost. Okay, let's see if I can stagger them using ice attacks. Now, I've already got arrow for the flying guys. 
Uh, wind materia, deadly dodge. I'll swap out deadly dodge right now for a cheeky bit of ice. Tifa's got this one, so I use this one. Cheeky uh, potion. I'm so glad I've got Kiragra available now as well. Can I hear noises? Okay, Icy Stagger. Defend this time. Oh! Oh, even with defense up, it still does for Sucky Sucky. Look at Mark Zuck over here. Okay. Blizzard, this one. Three. Let's finish this. Damn it. That's that. Was never in doubt. No, they just keep dying. Yeah, um, this might be too much of an ask, to be honest. Yes. Mate, I'm on those medals, so Let's have a quick sit-down. Even the suck. You got the stagger before it died. No, I'm not level grinding. I'm trying to... Um, I've got a... S oh, wait. Can I buy stuff from this vending machine as well? Potions, Phoenix Downs, and Antidotes. 300 gil for a Phoenix Down. I'll leave it for the moment. Yeah, I'm not quite on a grind. I'm more or less... Um, wait, did I just use this bench or not? I'm assuming I did. Uh, I'm on a Battle Intel vibe. I'm trying to stagger some stuff. Oh, it did stagger! Guys, thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Yeah, 10 out of 15. Okay. Guys, pat yourselves on the back. So I need to come across some of those aero fly boys now. Uh, lesser drakes. Weak against aero. Yeah. Piece of cake. Oh, there's that rabbit. What's that rabbit weak against? Fire? Assessment material went up. Lovely, lovely. Oh, it's over. Okay, there's also wear wraps. I need to double check what their vibe is. <laughs> Problem Nothing is, you can't look when you're in the battle, and I don't know what's in the area. So, what about the wear wraps? I've not staggered one of these either. Ice. Okay. I'll blizzard aware we're at next time with any luck as well. There's a lot to remember. Any uh, fly boys in here? Nope, just a creepy, mysterious area. Well floodlit. It's a rat. It's a wear rat, thank you very much. How dare you? I'm just like, ice, ice, arrow, arrow? Who? Which enemies are where again? been in here? I think so. Bring it. 
idea. Shit. Got that. Calling ice. Calling ice. Never in doubt. Calling ice, huh? Yeah, I'm on a bit of a loop here. Maybe those aero guys don't come out at night. Where rats from Final Fantasy VI? Yes, Bojack! They are! Bojack, have you seen the uh, model for them? They look way, way better now, but yeah, it's that Final Fantasy VI vibe. In six, they look super comical. But yeah. You're dead. Okay, so. No, let me attack the other thing. No, don't attack the wearer. I need him alive. Stop attacking the wearer. Oh my god. I'm clearly locked on to the um, bug. And yet, all I did was attack that poor innocent rat. Okay. Stagger. Yes, 11 out of 15. I didn't realize it literally says Nothing it on screen, but I'm super pleased. Okay, guys, we're getting there. No error, boys, though. Just come back towards the entrance. Easy. I'm just pressing attack a lot right now. Let's leave. I don't think we're coming across any of those flying lesser ones now, those lesser drakes. Oh, what is this? Oh, I just can't go here. So, where did we come in from? Let's call it for now. Hey, RH Zoo. How you doing, man? Long time no see. How you getting on? Kinda. Okay, so what about the animals in the other zone? Hmm. Encountered in the Sector 7 slums. I'll go to the other place to make sure there's none of them flying. Doom Rat. Oh, Doom Rats were in that little um, cubby area out back. Doom Rats were... Here, right? This is like a little place you can go. Yeah, let's go have a look over there. Yeah, back up here. Fingers crossed, brethren. I really don't think I can do it with the available enemies here. I've only just become aware of it 
but we had to do it recently. Oh, this guy's inventory changes quite a lot. Welcome. I'm always getting in new stuff to keep up with the latest trends. You won't be disappointed. Eleven hours. Wait, what? Cheap potions. Relatively cheap ethers. He's only got one for me, but I'll take it. For a hundred gil? Yeah, bruv. Nice one, man. Doom rats. It's just occurred to me to check their weakness. Oh, I'm in a combat area. I have to check their weakness here. There we go. Doom rats. I've not scanned them. I don't think I've scanned them. So I don't know their vibe. I'm assuming it's going to be ice again. With any luck, it'll be Blizzard. It wouldn't hurt to give them a scan as well. If we encounter any. Or is this just going to be a creepy, empty car park kind of vibe? Yeah, there's no random encounters. They're either there or they're not. No, not a repeat of Sekiro. We will we will eventually stop, but you know. Got stuff to investigate. Last area is just out by the zone zone, but we've already looked over here. I vibed up here when we landed. We've staggered everything we can. Hmm. Maybe. Should we check out the train graveyard entrance? I'm sure they won't let me in, but let's have a look. So basically, guys, if we go to bed, I think we're going to wake up tomorrow and it's going to be daytime again. And we might get those flying guys. Look at this. It's so great to have this and all this stuff in the background. There's so many different layers of what's just awesome in the background right now. And all this stuff in the slums. Wait, is this right? My eternal question is, is this the right way? It is. Oh, there's no Shinra guards here. They still won't let us through, though. Hmm. And obviously, there's just over here... Some ladder leading up to uh, a staircase near the pillar. Burning the midnight oil, are we? Keep your head on a swivel out there. That guy sounds like the dude Burning from Family Guy. Oil, are we? Keep your head on a swivel out there. Is it Joe? Never know. <gasps> Barriers to my success. Wait. Oh, the, oh, they've closed off the train station. I'm assuming that's a nighttime thing then. Well, we will go back to the slums then. Okay, guys, time to go to bed. We've done all we can. Irashaimas. Let's get a lovely night's kip. Where's the old lady? I guess she lives here. By the dog. This dog's a permanent fixture. Shall I try checking on uh, the other dude again? Oh, he's not even answering his door at all. And we've opened the chest that was up here, but let's just look once more. She's 
probably asleep. Okay, guys, I'm just gonna go for a really quick wee. I'll be right back. Oh, the sun's right in my face. All up in my business, isn't it? Yeah, be. Hey, that was super quick. Ran down, ran up. <sighs> Sleep until tomorrow. That's for proper rest until the next stage of the game, I guess. Yeah, I can't think of anything else to do about those um, enemy enemy fights. Hey guys, thanks for the welcome. Tranquil, I hope you're doing well, by the way. Doesn't even take his shoes off. Cloud? Yeah. You were out for a while. Just walking. <sighs> I ran into Johnny, by the way. Said not to worry, he was getting out of town. Uh. Oh, oh the dude I checked in that on. guy. You weren't thinking of leaving Midgar anytime soon, were you? Hmm. Well, seems this old friend of mine's in a tight spot. Long time ago, I said I'd be there for her. Made a promise. So... <sighs> Can't say this is quite what I had in mind when I put that on you way back when. If you want to talk, I'm listening. Huh? What's with you all of a sudden? With me? Like you're losing that hard edge. That bad? Not at all. I like it. Maybe Marlene won't be so scared of you next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really glad to have you back, Cloud. Really glad. Oh, it's pretty late, huh? I'd like to catch up more, but we should probably both get some sleep, yeah? Yeah. Good Unless... Night, Good night, Tifa. That's really sweet between them. I like that Cloud came to that conclusion a bit earlier, when we were on that other raid. think they're related to Johnny. What's wrong? Come with me. Quickly. Fucking dementors. We were getting ready to set out when those things showed up and came after us. The others? Barrett and Jesse are holding their ground, but for how long? I don't know. Let's go. Right. Is this real? 
Is this really happening? Ready? You know it. Um, let's head to the bar. Okay. Uh, what's what's T forgot right now? Like nothing? Can I stack one of these mysterious specters? Cloud, could you scam one of these, please? Unable to read. Physical attacks only have a slight effect on their stagger gauge, so use magic to, magic to fill it rapidly. They're immune to status ailments. Oh my god. Okay, so we're going to magic our way through these assholes. Staggered! Well, whatever happened, I staggered him. 12 out of 15. That's what I like to hear. Man, I really hope we did. I got it. Chakra mate, I love when you go into slow time, you still get to scan around and you just get this like really desaturated moment in the middle of a fight. Tifa about to use Chakra surrounded by Dementors. This game mate. Do this right. She's just about to use Blizzard, maybe? Do you see that she just came out of a jump and cast Blizzard underhand as a throw? Mate. Oh, she's getting fucked. Brilliant, Cloud just uh, did deflect on that. Let's blizzard this guy. Cloud, you wanna you wanna do some of the same? Bit of thunder? No holding back. Oh wait, we're supposed to be going somewhere, I forgot. Can, can I actually leave? Or do we have to fight our way into a gap? Yeah, there's no way out. We're kind of... Oh, we did it. We did it. No idea. Pretty sure you can't even see them unless they make physical contact first. That's all you can tell me? More of them? We're running out of time. Any other way? Yeah, over here. What about the rumors of a secret Shinra lab underground? Is that just a, like, storyline we're going to come back to later? Again? Are they trying to stop us from reaching the others? Cloud, this way! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! It's like trying to fight a hurricane! Stay on your feet. You don't have to tell me that. Okay, we're pushing through. Where's everybody else? Are these related to the guys in the cowls with the numbers tattooed? Like Johnny with number 49? Or are these something else completely? Unless... Death Eaters! You know, Death Eater is a real thing. A Death Eater is a man who eats dinner off of a coffin of a dead person. She's found. Oh, physical attacks are useless. I remember. There we go. Sorry, Tifa, I should have done that 10 minutes ago. That one's on me. They're not taking off that much health, that's the thing. Yeah. 
Okay, let's use unbridled strength three times. And now we've got rise and fall. Oh, nice, it's a punch kick combo, the old rise and fall. Omni strike. This one's purple. Enigmatic Spectre. Cloud, 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 cloud. Scan this bad boy. Scan it. I know he's staggered, but dude, talk to me about this enigmatic boy. And cloud, stagger your enigmatic boy. Stagger your enigmatic boy. Oh. Get it, get a stagger, get a stagger. Deal with that. Let me He's pressured. Yes. Oh, what is it doing now? You're up. Take it over. Oh, cloud, cloud. Oh, he's got no abilities. Come on, Cloud. Get that stagger. He's pressured. He's doing stuff. Get that pressure up. Yes. Going in. Mate, stagger dreams. I'm staggering everyone in bed, Dad. Mate. Are you a band from the 80s? Because I fucking love to see you. My name is Mick Stagger. Ooh. That's all I've got time for. There. Now's our chance. Seizing the Whirling up a car, yes, mate. Enigmatic Spectre defeated. How's your ammo? Running low. Jesse. Has she been possessed? Uh, easy now. What's going on? What's happening? Oh. We ain't putting on a damn show. So, where are those things? Some kind of. I don't know. We're the only ones that saw that. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. The so only ones that were never affected. Can tell what weird shit will come crawling out of the scrap down here. It's those reactors. I'm telling you. It hurt. Wish I could say it didn't, but. Yeah. <laughs> God, this is so embarrassing. She loves it. Playing the damsel in distress. <gasps> Teeth is not happy. It's kind of amazing that you know about Death Eaters. Chameleon S, of course you know about Death Eaters as well. Of course you, you do, do Chameleon S. You are did, did, does it hurt? Not of knowledge. nearly as much as the fuss everyone's making. Still, I think you ought to avoid putting any- I'm fine! Oh. Oh, that's enough. You're out, Jesse. Huh? What about the mission? We already sent Biggs in, remember? Don't tell me you're thinking of calling it off! Uh, no, we got this. The hell you do. <laughs> if you need someone to step up, I'm your man! <laughs> oh, oh. Okay. I'm sad, yeah. So here's the thing. Tendary versus Tendary. I'm race. <laughs> Good. Consider it done. All right, everyone. Clouds in. The mission is on. Go and raise some help for me, okay? <laughs> Listen, Wedge. I need you to hang back and guard the home front. What? But I'm in perfect health. 
Which makes you the perfect choice to look after Jesse and Marlene. <sighs> hey. Let's get this show on the road to Marco Reactor 5. Once you got your gear in order, head to the station for the meet. Got it? Hmm. <laughs> This will help you get squared away. Don't tell me I never did nothing for you. Another 500. I'm counting on you, soldier boy. I still don't think they've paid me in full. <sighs> Cheers, communist. I got it. I saw it as well. Thank you. Well, 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 my friends. Another fucking... Weird fucking event. I thought that was a dream or a nightmare, but Dementors attacked this area of the slums. Only those who've been touched by them are then susceptible for, to their attacks and actually have to deal with them and see them and feel them. Something in the Never? Is it related to the rumours of a secret operation below? Is it instead related to the guys who are wearing the cloaks who are just like, REUNION! But one of those guys said he left, but he wasn't really capable of a speech. But Tifa says that he'd been communicating with her and that he was just heading back to his hometown for a few days? Is that true? Or is that maybe some kind of false memory? And Jesse, just, just injured? Or possessed by an evil spirit? I'm not so sure, my friends. Guys, we've got a lot to do. It's still daytime. We're still in the slums. We might still be able to unlock our other staggers because we did quite well. Join me in the next episode, you delicious things, for more Final Fantasy VII Remake adventures. See you then. Take care.